Hey guys, Bamwalk Studios here, and today I'm going to be doing a mod install tutorial. Uh, today's one's going to be on uh, the water shaders mod for Minecraft. This has been recently reviewed by some big YouTubers. Um, uh, Captain Sparkles has done it, um, Yogscast has done it, things like that. And um, a couple of people asked me questions on have I got it, how I installed it, and uh, I don't. Well, I have recently installed it, so I can do a video on showing you guys how to do it, because a couple of people had a, some questions on how to do it, and... Um, so I'm just doing this video to wrap it up and show people how. So what you're gonna need is a mod loader and the water shaders mod. Both download links for the that, that will be down in the description. Just go ahead and click them, download them, put them on your desktop. You're gonna need WinRAR to install them as well. So if you don't know WinRAR, also a link for that in the description. But if you've done any Minecraft modding, uh, you'll most likely have it. So uh, for the water shaders mod, you don't actually need mod loader. The version I'm doing, you need mod loader because I'm done a fresh install of Minecraft. Um, I've forced to update it, so you're going to need ModLoader. If you if you already have ModLoader, the most recent version of ModLoader installed on your um, computer, on your Minecraft, you can skip the part where I install ModLoader, but um, apart from that, you want to do the water shader part. So, once you've got them onto your desktop, you want to open up the water shader one, and uh, you want to close that, drag both these files onto your desktop, and you can exit out of that. And uh, now you want to go to, down here, your start bar, if you're running Windows XP, there'll be something on the side here saying run. You want to click that, but if you're on Windows 7 or Vista, you want to just run down here and uh, click run there. So now you want, uh, once you're in run, you want to type in percent app data percent and hit enter. Now you want to go dot Minecraft. You want to go into your bin folder and uh, sorry, let me just delete that. Um, for the shader file, you have um, from the uh, the shaders mod, the one that says shader, you should drag and drop that. Oh, you're gonna drag and drop that into your bin folder, just the bin folder, just like that. Now you want to go to Minecraft, the one that just says Minecraft, nothing else, and right click, open with, when you're our archiver. Now wait for the message to pop up, click close, and you want to make sure you have this file here, meta dash imp deleted. If uh, you don't have it on there then you've probably already deleted it and it will run smoothly. Apart from if you don't have it deleted then you, it, this mod will not work and it will mess up. So now the one that says Minecraft you want to double click on that and all the files in there you want to highlight all of them and drag and drop them into your minecraft.jar. Click OK and uh, now you're pretty much done. Um, oh no sorry we're not done. Oh fail on my part. You want to go into mod loader now and you want to just select all the files in here, drag and drop them into the minecraft.jar, and now you are done. So if we open up Minecraft here, just run a quick test. Come on, come on. So um, this mod's actually currently in alpha at the moment, so it's there are still some bugs to it and things like that, but that's to be expected in such a such a high um, resolution uh, modder, let's say. Oh, let's play offline. Doesn't seem to be working at the moment. There, uh, yeah. Okay, so single player, I have a world set up here, just for you to test it, and if you go into it, straight off you can see the water is changed. It's, um, it's, I can say realistic, a lot more realistic, you can see that, um, it actually ripples while moving. Like that, you probably can't see it well because I'm recording with Camtasia, so there will be a bit of lag in Minecraft. But if you throw, um, things into it, it doesn't actually make ripples. Which obviously, hopefully, well not obviously, hopefully they will change in later patches to this. And hopefully change the bubbles when you go into the water. You can see the bubbles just come out. They're not um, high resolution bubbles, which I think would be awesome to see. So I thank you very much, everyone, for watching. You can see the reflections as well. And if this worked for you, please leave a like on this video. If you haven't already, so please subscribe for more Minecraft videos. I've got loads and loads and loads and loads and loads of them. I uh, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. Until next time, goodbye.